Can you also shed some light on the side effect profile of Avelumab mm -hmm. and how should community oncologists help manage some of these side effects for their patients? Yeah, so I, I think it's important to um, state that Avelumab is given th as an IV infusion. It takes about 60 minutes to give and we give it every two weeks and the dose is 10 milligrams per kilogram, so relatively simple. The major side effects that we've seen with this drug have been fatigue and infusion-related reactions. So we do recommend that patients be pre-medicated. We typically use a combination of Tylenol and Benadryl which can, that can prevent these infusion-type reactions. There were a small number of patients who did, in fact, experience immune-mediated adverse events, so similar to what we see with other uh, T-cell checkpoint inhibitors. These were generally low-grade, but it's important to keep in mind that these can occur and we would then treat those with corticosteroids like we would with um, the other agents. In general, it's a fairly well-tolerated uh, drug.